Hello, in this video, we're going to take another look at the deals all the reactions. In this video, the particular case when the diene and the dienophile are asymmetric. In this case, the dienes will either be 1 amino, 1 4 butadiene, or 2 amino, 1 4 butadiene, and the dienophile is going to be propenal. Here is the geometry optimized structure of the cis 1 amino 1 4 butadiene or diene for the first case. Here is the optimized structure of propenal, the dienophile. Here is the computed transition state for the deals auger reaction of propionyl and the 1 amino 1 4 butadiene oriented in such a way as to give an ortho arrangement of the substituents when the final ring is formed. Here we have the optimized structure of the product of the Diels Alder reaction, more clearly showing that the amino and the ethanol uh, substituents are ortho to each other, ultimately within a cyclohexene ring. Again, for the second case, our diene is going to be the 1 amino 1 4 butadiene. And the dienophile is propionyl. Here is the transition state for the Diels Alder reaction, where the 1 amino 1 4 butadiene and propionyl are oriented in such a way as to make the substituents meta to each other. Here is the product of that Diels Alder reaction, showing the substituents being meta to each other. Here again is table one. The two cases that we have examined so far are shown on the first two lines, the ortho and the meta orientations. And we see that the energy of activation for the ortho case is much smaller than for the meta case, suggesting that the ortho orientation is favored. We also notice that there is um, roughly the equivalent uh, values for the enthalpy of activation. It's strongly exothermic with virtually the same amount for whether it's the ortho or meta orientation. For our final two cases, the diene is going to be the cis 2 amino 1 4 butadiene. while the dienophile is still propenal.
here is the transition state for the Diels auto reaction between those dienophile and the diene, such that we get a meta orientation of the two substituents. And here is the geometry optimized product showing again the amino and ethanol uh, substituents being met to each other within a cyclohexene ring. For our final reaction, again, the Diene will be the 2 amino 1 4 butadiene. With the dienophile being pro female. Here is the computed transition state for that particular reaction in such a way that the orientation of the two uh, substituents is now going to be para. Here is the optimized product for the reaction giving the para orientation of the substituent. Here again is table one. The last two reactions that we looked at are described on lines three and four. And we see that we have either a meta or a para orientation, and that the energy of activation for the para orientation is substantially smaller than for the meta, seeing, showing that para is favored over meta in this case. As a result, we suspect that a general rule would be that in Diels Alda reactions, that orso and para orientations will be favored and meta orientations will be less favored. The doesn't seem to be so much of a difference in the overall enthalpy of reaction, but the energy of activation is substantially different. I thank you very much for your kind attention. Please stay safe out there. And as always, have a good one.